All right, we're here with... You look good. I think you look good. Okay. <laughs> Evan Jenkins here at Michigan State University. I want to see how pumped these fans are for the rivalry week against Michigan. We're going to have a little fun here today. I'm going to play a little word association with you and see what you think of these words when I say them. Jim Harbaugh. Khaki pants. Okay. When I say the big house, you say... Sucky. Yes, I love it. Okay, when I say Wolverine, you say... We're gonna beat your ass. Right, I love it. Okay, Riley's got a little sass to her in the morning, if you can tell. There's a, a football game going on this weekend. I'm not sure if you've heard. Um, who do you think is gonna win? Michigan State, of course. Of course, right? I've asked other people and they were a little hesitant. Why do you think they're hesitant? Um, Michigan's actually good this year. Ooh, are you sure you want to say that on camera, being a Michigan State student? I am here with Mike Sullivan, not to be confused with the tool that I work with. <laughs> The reason I stopped you was because one question I asked you, do you hate Michigan? Oh, of course, I absolutely hate Michigan. And there's nothing about them you like? Not really, no, absolutely not. So when I say the name Jim Harbaugh to you, your response is? Oh, cringe, I absolutely cringe. Every single time I hear that name, that is the only thing I do. God, I hate it. If I were to say the name Big House to you, you would say back to me? Spartan Stadium. Okay, so which stadium is better in your opinion? Spartan Stadium. By a lot, right? Absolutely. If I say the term Spartan to you, what do you associate that with? East Lansing and not much. What about Mark D'Antonio? Slime. I say Spartan, you say? Sucks. When I say East Lansing, you say? Beautiful campus. Oh my goodness, can you believe that, Courtney? She loves Michigan State. Okay, what do you guys think is going to happen on Saturday? I think we're going to give Little Brother a run for their money. Little Brother, so that's interesting that you say that term. What do you guys think is going to happen in the game on Saturday? We're going to win. By a lot? Enough that Valenny will cry. Okay, okay. Enough that Valenny will cry. Okay, so I'm going to ask you a couple riddles and see if you can solve them real fast, okay? Oh boy. Okay, so my friend Mark has 15 chicken wings. He ate all but seven. How many are left? He ate all but seven. You count on your fingers? Uh -huh. okay. How many did <laughs> he ate all but seven? Mm -hmm. So seven are left. Yes, yes, Kendall <laughs> nailed it. He ate, he ate all It's not eight. All but, oh, seven. seven. I'm go. sorry. I'm... Eight. Seven. Seven. Beautiful. Six. Seven. He ate all but seven. All but seven. <laughs> oh, okay. okay. We got her on that one. Okay. We got her there. Seven. Can you spell ghost for me? G-H-O-S-T. Okay, can you spell roast for me? R-O-A-S-T. Can you spell toast for me? T-O-A-S-T. What goes inside of a toaster? Bread. Ooh, look at her. Okay, that's good. Bread. Ooh, okay. Wait, can you read that one more time? Toast. Bread. Toast. Toast. Bread. <laughs> Come on, Riley. <laughs> Bread. Ooh, okay. He's good there. Divide 50 by 2 and add 40. What's the answer? 65. Oh, my goodness. You sure you're not a math major? I'm not. Okay. <laughs> There we go. Okay, so you weren't out late last night partying I'm then, not right? Good at math. 65. All right, that's very good. A plane crashes on the Michigan Ohio border. Where do they bury the survivors? You don't bury survivors. This guy, he's <laughs> killing it today. So I just have one question. How anxious were you guys to bust out the boots today? Uh, I was pretty excited. Yeah, first boot day. I was real excited. I'm really glad you pointed that out. See, yeah. I know what I'm talking about. <laughs> 